Your iPhone and iPad has a scanner built into it to scan any document and turn it into a PDF. And it's really, really powerful. In fact, my scanner back there most of the time doesn't work and it's not even as high resolution as the scanner built in. Let me show you exactly how to use it. I actually had to send this to the city and they required a PDF. I couldn't just take a JPEG, for example, and send it. And this PDF is a much better, crisper quality. So it's built into the Notes app. The Notes app comes with every iPhone. This is what it looks like. And when you open up the Notes app, just press the Note icon on the bottom of the page and you'll come into a brand new note here. Now, all you have to do is press the camera icon right here in the center and then it lets you scan a document. That's what you wanna do. You don't wanna take a photo or video, you wanna scan. And one more setting I typically change right on top if you press this icon. If you know you wanna scan something in black and white, which is the case here, I'm gonna choose that. If you're scanning a photo, choose photo. If you're scanning something with color, choose that. I'll choose black and white. I'll pick up my phone and I'm gonna just go and hold it like this and I'll just press the picture icon and look at that, just like that, it figured out what my image should be. And I could actually go ahead and change the size here if I don't wanna scan the whole image or the whole paper, but I do in this case. So I'll keep scan on the bottom. And just like that, it saved it for me. So let me open it up here and look at that. Look at the quality of this. I could zoom way in and it's very, very high resolution and something I couldn't do with my scanner printer combo. So. Now you could go ahead and spin this around. You have some edit options over here. You could still crop it if you need to. So that option is gonna come back and you could actually change it to color, to grayscale or to photo if you need to change it on this page. When you're happy with it, I'm gonna press done here. I'll press save and I could save this in my notes. So I'll just press done. Now I need to send it to someone, right? So I press the three dots on top here and it says send a copy, press that. And then you could go ahead and email it directly from here or send it as a message and it will attach that PDF. This is not a JPEG, it's a PDF document right from your messages. Or most of the time I do scan these for email. So I choose the email option and draft my email. If you've never used this before, I think you're really gonna be impressed the first time you scan any document. And I really do prefer it over my traditional printer scanner combo for scanning documents. I hope you found this useful. Please give it a thumbs up. I post easy to follow tech videos every single day and I hope to catch you next time.